This Sunday, we're going to be starting our new series, Running with the Giants. And it's a series where we look at characters in the Bible who can teach us something, giants of the faith who can encourage us as we run our race of life and our race of faith. And so do join us. We've done Running with the Giants uh, for the last few summers. And it's a great series to have in the summer as we dip in and out of different characters. And we thought it'd be really helpful as well to have a familiar series at the moment, uh, because in this season of pandemics and all sorts, it's hard to know what day it is, uh, let alone which season. And so we thought to have the summer series to stay as Running With The Giants would be really helpful for us all to know. And this season, we felt God say to us, not just to do random characters, but he, there's a theme running through how we're going to teach Running With The Giants and looking at how we bring fruitfulness from tough times. Now, interesting enough, the six Bible characters and their births were totally, totally supernatural. So actually, they were born into impossible situations and their lives represent the sense that God can bring fruitfulness even in the most challenging season. So we're going to look at uh, Isaac and then Jacob and then Joseph and then Samson and then Samuel and finish off with John the Baptist. All of their stories represent something about how we can trust God to bring something good out of a time of challenge. So Isaac, for example, his name means laughter. And so how can you keep hold of your sense of joy even when life is a struggle? For uh, Jacob, he underwent incredible character transformation. So every trial and adversity that he went through, God was able to use to form and fashion something wonderful in his life. So we're going to look at how our characters can be formed through times of challenge. And then with Joseph, he actually prospered in every season, whether he was in prison or whether he was a free man. And he managed to prosper because he always had that sense of being clothed in his father's love and so every one of the characters we're going to draw out a different as aspect of their life that demonstrates for us and helps us helps unlock how we can uh, go through times of adversity but still be those who prosper and bear good fruit so come and tune in this coming Sunday why not invite someone that you know one of your friends because everybody has been going through a challenging season over these last few months why not invite them to taste church and to learn something to help us all prosper through this time. So why not join us this coming Sunday, 10.20 with our family time, and then on all the way through till about 11.30. Uh, join us for Running with the Giants.